I've been using transgressive burner, cross stand, and stainless steel pot since we moved to Marina last October. Please excuse the way it looks because I've been using them last nine months. However, their functionality has never been changed. When I bought the boat, it was completely empty and I knew that when we moved to New Marina, I had to stay in the boat for a couple days. Therefore, I need a temporary solution uh, for me to able to uh, make uh, boiling water for tea or coffee or making some basic cookings. Therefore, I bought these three items. Let's have a look at the Trangia Spirit Burner. Trangia is well-known Sweden company and they produce products since 1950. This compact Spirit Burner is light and very efficient. It comes with the, this uh, box. According to the Trangia website, this burner made for outdoors. However, it can be also used indoors as long as there, there is the air ventilation and uh, there is nothing around the burner when it is on fire. It's also a good idea to have a fire protection surface under the burner. The burner has an alcohol fuel tank uh, just in the middle and um, there is a uh, cotton mix around this uh, circle uh, brass. The cotton mix uh, sucks some of the alcohol and then the alcohol comes from these holes which I found very unique because when the fire is on the fire goes everywhere equivalently under the pot. The fuel tank takes about 100 mil and burns around 25 uh, minutes. Uh, of course, this depends on the uh, conditions. Trangia advised to use methylated spirit alcohol and I use this alcohol. Methanol or wood alcohol can also be used according to the website as long as it is over 70%. I buy methylated alcohol from eBay as a 5 liter container. It cost me around 22 pounds and lasts me nearly 3 months as I only use during the weekends. One negative uh, point with this burner is that during the winter months I found difficulties to put on fire. I had to try maybe 4 5 times to put on fire and even if it's on the fire I have to keep eye on it on the fire make sure that uh, the fire is on because uh, sometimes uh, the fire goes off naturally. I believe that uh, this is because of the uh, alcohol burner uh, become less responsive to the fire during the cold temperature and Trangia is also aware of this they mention on their website. They even uh, produce uh, another unit uh, like a warmer and then these units um, keep the uh, spirit burner warm and then after rules you can put the uh, spirit burner on fire. At the moment the fire is on on the spirit burner. There is a, enough air ventilation on the boat and there is nothing around the burner apart from the uh, cross stand. Hopefully you can pick up from the camera that the fire is also coming from these small holes and and I believe that that makes um, more uh, efficient to use the fire under the pot. Trangia cost me around 17 pounds from Amazon. By the time I bought uh, this product there were over 4000 reviews and their score was 4.8 out of 5. I found that is impressive and after nine months, um, I found that this product from Trangia is very useful, very efficient and worth it for every penny. When I was buying the separate burner, the Amazon system suggests me these two cross stands and I thought that was a good idea. So I bought with the separate burner. The cross stand fits the separate burner perfectly and it can go around easily.
it makes from stainless steel and as you can see I've been using one of them last nine months and the other one is backup it cost me around eight pounds and since I've been using uh, I did not see any negative points yet uh, so the sprit burner cross stand uh, works very well and when I put pot on top of the cross stand that makes perfect setup I have chosen this pot because I can use for different purposes this pot has been made from stainless steel and can take up to 750 mil we can see the 300 mil and 500 mil marks in here the pot has a folding handle which I find very useful especially for wood fire the lid has got three holes for steam and small gasp the handle on the side is stainless steel and movable when it's taken from the fire extra attention needs to be given because this handle can get very hot I use this pot for different purposes first of all boiling water I normally use around 300 mil for boiling water and it takes about between four and six minutes this depends on the room temperature secondly I use this pot for warming up the foods it can be canned foods or ready-made foods to do this I use a little bit of water at the bottom of the pot and wait until it gets near the boiling stage then I put the food into the pot and mix with the hot water wait until the steam comes from these holes at this stage I know that the food is getting warmer and I just wait until the right time then I just check the food temperature if it is ready I put in a bowl and clean the pot for next use I use this pot as a mug or cup I can drink coffee or tea or water I can even drink warm soup from this pot finally I use this pot as a steamer I can steam vegetables rice even fish like a salmon to do this I put a little bit water at the bottom and wait until the water gets boiling stage and wait until the steam comes out from these holes once the steam comes out from those holes I know that there is a enough steam inside of the pot and cooking process started in that stage I wait until the right time I check food temperature if it is ready I put the food in a plate get rid of from hot water wash the pot for next use this pot cost me around 28 pounds from Amazon although stainless steel color has changed the quality hasn't changed I think the quality and price combination it is okay Trangia cross stand and pot combination is only temper resolution and I do not use this setup during the sale I am planning to develop a cooking system which will take some time at the moment full fire is on on the spirit burner and I am steaming asparagus so we can see from here that the steam is coming out from the lid and let's have a look uh, so this same um, clearly can be seen that the steam is coming out and let's have a look uh, yes um, the asparagus is on the way and uh, to cook uh, properly so it probably it takes about another uh, two or three minutes and then I'll check the uh, temperature and and then I'll take from the pot to the plate and then hopefully it will be a good lunch